Protect our care, protect our homes. That's the message from nursing home residents in western New York tonight. With the state looking to cut back on Medicaid reimbursements, patients are concerned for their future as health care costs soar. Take a look at these staggering numbers. Here in western New York, nursing home care costs about $347 per day. That quickly adds up to more than $126,000 a year. Southern Eyewitness News reporter Ed Riley looks at why the state is moving forward with a proposal some worry could be devastating. We're just here because we're old and somebody has to take care of us. Shirley Swikert, 82, is a long-term resident at the Garden Gate Healthcare Facility in Cheektowaga. She needs Medicaid to pay her bill. We got all our paperwork and everything and it's going on seven months. But waiting for approval is not her only concern. Shirley is also worried about New York State's plan to cut Medicaid reimbursement rates for nursing homes. Every day you think about it because you don't know. As part of the 2020 fiscal year state budget, the Department of Health is changing the method used to reimburse nursing homes for Medicaid costs. The department said it is needed to make sure nursing homes are paid accurately and fairly based on care needs. The Department of Health is planning a massive $250 million cut that will impact nearly 75% of residents across the state. The change has many very upset because it is being applied retroactively. We're going to really wreak havoc with an already fragile nursing home industry. During a news conference at the Garden Gate facility, state lawmakers, nursing home administrators, and the Health Care Education Project voiced their concerns. This affects everybody. This is for-profit facilities, nonprofits, faith-based and hospital-based. Garden Gate stands to lose close to $400,000 in Medicaid reimbursement. And for other nursing homes already running in the red, the cuts could be devastating. It's likely to lead to more bankruptcies, uh, and more sales. The whole situation has left nursing home residents like Shirley Swikert wondering what will happen to her care and cost. I don't want anything to happen to all this. I don't, I think it would be a terrible, terrible stress. Advocates for this issue are now urging the general public to contact Governor Cuomo's office and voice their opposition. In Chictawaga, Ed Riley, 7 Eyewitness News.